Well, the Beltrami County History Center is playing host to a new exhibit dedicated to all things sports. In tonight's In Focus, our Mary Keeler gets a closer look at what makes up good sports of the norm. Almost 10 days ago, a new exhibit called Good Sports of the North opened at the Beltrami County History Center. Good Sports of the North tells stories. There are 15 plus display panels telling different stories about sports in Beltrami County or in and around Beltrami County. A grant from the George W. Nielsen Foundation and donations from Kent and Carol Wilson made the exhibit possible. Everything from traditional team sports like basketball and football to things that are more Minnesota-ish, northern Minnesota-ish, uh, like curling, cross-country skiing. The theme that loosely ties everything together is community. So how did sports uh, impact communities? How did they shape families? And what did it mean for the area? And another interactive part of this exhibit is the locker room. Visitors can try on vintage baseball uniforms, helmets for football from the 1950s, and also try out an Ojibwe lacrosse stick. It's interactive, so kids, adults can open the lockers, try things out. As the curator of Good Sports of the North, Dan has developed a few of his own favorite pieces and stories. Bill Lawrence and his brothers were, I think, grew up in Red Lake and then moved to Bemidji and were stars in multiple high school sports. And then the generation before them, uh, Bill's dad and his brothers, same idea, they were multi-sport athletes in Red Lake. Bill Lawrence and his brother would go from town to town to play special games. It was that you can connect towns and it made the family feel really important. There's still plenty of time to see the exhibit before the final buzzer rings at the end of summer 2016. The exhibit highlights those stories. It doesn't cover everything. So it, it, uh, it explores stories that are emblematic of sports in this area. What started as a pile of sports records has now turned into a manifestation of community pride from today and back in the day. For this week's In Focus in Bemidji, no, no, no. Mary Keeler, Lakeland News. And you can visit the exhibit at the History Center anytime between 12 and 4 Wednesday through Saturday or by appointment. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.